We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Kendrick, J. Cole. I don't even want to say Drake. Let's take Drake out of this whole thing. Let's take Drake out. Yes, you, Which is crazy. Y'all leave crazy. Drake alone. The best rapper yeah, alive. Drake out, the best musician alive, bro. We can, we can mention Drake, but I don't want to mention Drake. Right. Hold so on. We're just going to say... We team OVO over here. Hold up. You know I mean? Nah, B team OVO. B team OVO. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Um, but team Ghost Rider. As we team Ghost Rider, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> team hits. Um, yes, I'm pretty yes. sure. Oh, right right. um, I'm pretty sure y'all already know. Um, we're not going to the whole background. We're not doing all that bullshit. Kendrick said something. J. Cole responded, and Kendrick made uh, probably like a few lines, wasn't even something really big like that. And then J. Cole came out with a whole project uh, compared to his line. No, it's not. They know that. Hold on. What? Now what happened? All right, what? so. Wait, wait, so. wait, wait, wait. wait. Yeah. Do not yeah. go into the full history. You know, no, we're just gonna talk about. Oh, but you just said, about hold on, you say you say he made a whole project. For yeah, that's. I'm gonna get into those two things that you said wrong. Don't worry about it. Um, the first one is the whole project is not about Kendrick. It's only one song. No, which is that was, seven yo, minute drill. Hold on, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. He said more about Kendrick and then that one song in seven minute drill. Stop it. Did you listen to it? I listen to the whole project. I listen to that shit every damn you know, day. I, so I, you know what? I see. This is this is why. Nah, I say. there was only nah, there was only one other song that he really. He might have mentioned him, but it was only no, one song I'm, he I'm talked with, about Kendrick. Bro, I know what Killer said. I know what Killer said. I'm not gonna lie, but he didn't say his name. It wasn't that. Oh, but Killer is absolute. I felt because I listened to the project was out too. I'm just saying, I'm with Killer on that. I felt like it was more than just that. It was more than like one that. song, and it was more than two songs. We could go back. Now, he did not directly say him into that bullshit seven minute shit, but he threw shots. And you know that because you listen to the other songs. He even said on the other song, Yo, I ain't want to have to do this to my brother. Bro, who he talking about? Stop it. Come on. But that's a natural thing for an artist to do, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. But when you going at an artist like Kendrick Lamar, you know what he's capable of. You can't throw many shots at that nigga and throw the white flag up. What type of bitch shit well, is that? But I, w I wanted to say something before you rudely interrupted me. You was First of all, monster. you said it was only seven minutes. That's wrong. No, that's seven. No, that was a song he really went at Kendrick. That's the one he even apologized for. That's the one he addressed himself on on his dream fest Like whether he says some 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 blemish shit on some J shit or whatever on the rest of the. Uh, Whatever they, how many songs were twelve? I think if he said some shit on the other eleven songs, seven minutes he actually talked directly about Kendrick. That was a direct diss. He talked about we, how many albums he has. He broke down. That. So that was a direct diss. Mm -hmm. What was crazy about it was when Kendrick said the big three, he was mainly going that Drake in that big three. Yeah, he said some about the big three, but he said for your dog, she he named a couple different. He was pretty. He was taking shots really at, at Drake mostly. And, Dr and J. Cole happened to be in that big three and was like, what the fuck? Like, I'm, you're not getting, and that's where he responded. So I think that he felt some type of way about how he responded for something that really wasn't for him when he, he sat back and actually thought about it because he probably was influenced to diss him. But I ain't gonna lie, I sound like you listening to a whole lot of people that's talking and a whole lot of comments you probably reading. Cause nah, you sound but... just like the comics right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, listen, I, I want to keep it a button. This is cutting the cap. Please say this is some big shit, huh? Please say yo, this is not I, a Yo, problem. listen, I'm go keep you know I'm coming with it. I'm coming with it. Listen. Please. I'm telling you right now, I'm not you with J. Cole no more. It's over. Thank I you. rock with J. Cole as far as his lyricism and all. He's the greatest. 
But yo, how you back out of a rap beef when there is there nothing can happen to you but bars? This is hip hop, bro. This is you supposed to defend your honor. You're not Thank gonna you. get touched at all. Thank this was you. on paper. It was time for you to do what we all mm -hmm. love to do: lyrical exercise. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Lyrical exercise. One day, listen, and just so y'all, I know I ain't capping. I was walking with war one day, and I forgot where we was, and I was like, "Yo, I gotta step my game up. I gotta get my bars right." This was the moment for the world to see that J. Cole <laughs> was that dude. Stop playing. Who was number one? And once again, y'all allowed Drake to make mm -hmm. you look crazy because Drake ain't never apologized. He got a thousand songs saying the other side, I'm not apologizing. He's still throwing shots at Ye. He's still throwing shots at this person, that person. And J. Cole, you talking about you losing sleep over... Bro, you're done. I'm done with J. Cole when it comes. Yeah, bro. I'm convinced. But I'm going to let y'all talk because I'm going to say my part last. So, boy, J. Cole is ass uh, for that. And I love you, J. Cole. You're my guy. But you ass for that, bro. You want to go wall or you want me to go? Oh, yo. Let me add one thing. Anybody that agree with him, you just as soft as he is. Because that's real. I don't even want to go there. But that's soft, bro. Soft. That's not hip hop. Right, that's not hip hop, bro. That's ass. Listen, okay. I was mad that it happened, but I respected it. What you respected? I want to hear this. I respected it because he's over this battle and shit. He already knows he at the top. Bro, he just made a project. He just the whole nigga in seven minutes. He's nowhere over battle shit. What? But when you hear him talk about it on the Dreamville and how he talks about it, he really didn't want, he was influenced to do that shit. He didn't want to do that. Because he went at a nigga that he know about to take his neck off, bro. He's about to lose his crown. <laughs> And hell, hell no, I no, I don't think he would. If they went to battle, I don't think he would have got smoked in in any form. What? I don't think J Cole would have got smoked in any form. No, bro, in a battle, you, you me answer, five. Did you hear the hard part four? The what? The hard part four. No. Did you hear that from Kendrick? Bro, no. Kendrick said this shit years ago when he did the shit on April seventh. He even said, "Yo." I don't want to hear no, yeah, I'm your man, I ain't mean to do that type shit, blah, blah, blah. Nah, bro, nigga said this shit, and what, what a fucking coincidence, on April 7th, when Kendrick dropped that shit in 2021, this nigga J. Cole gets on the fucking stage and says, yo, you know you my man, I ain't mean to do that shit. What a fucking coincidence, bro. This nigga seen the fucking future, bro. Dude, again, I still don't think... Kendrick would have watched to, Cole by oh any means. Oh my God, bro. You need to. By any, if that battle would have took place, I would not have seen him. What? Hell no. Well, we'll never see it because he's so soft. No, no, he's that's not true. Soft, no, that's not true because Kendrick could still come out with a diss and the shit, it, we'll hear what Kendrick has to say. Because Kendrick is not going to back down, right? We're going to hear what Kendrick have to say. No, a and battle is not a battle unless both of them are battling. Bro, He's no you, longer bro. battling, bro. It's over. <laughs> now, right, he just left big old Drake and Kendrick. No, you know what just, he just moved out the way, bro. He, no, I want to hear what Wall got to say, man. got an album coming out, too. So. <laughs> Wall, please. I don't even know what you're going to say, but please speak your mind, brother. Nah, listen. Actually, I think I'm going to surprise y'all on this one. Oh, hell no. Okay. I'm I'm fucking with Cole on this, man. Oh Jesus Christ! All right, so Please listen, explain. I would love to hear this. Listen, I'm a. I, I think I'm just like y'all from the standpoint of you know I would have loved to see this. You yeah, know I would love to see that shit. Lyrical standpoint, I mean, two two giants going at it. We love huh. fire. I don't think. Just just to reply to something bad shit. I don't think. I don't think Cole is thinking he can touch. You know what I'm saying? I don't think any of that has anything. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? No, nah, no, nah, but I don't think I don't think that's his reasoning uh, for falling back. You know no, I'm saying? I'm saying he should that's more of a reason to battle. This ain't right, right, right. Pac. But I think ain't... I think yeah, but I think this is a situation of, you know, his relationship with Kendrick. You know what I'm saying? I think he he obviously considers Kendrick. No, I mean that's his man. He considers him his man. You feel me? So mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm not that's like me and that's like me and listen, if No, you can't compare listen, that. I'm I I am i am gonna compare it because obviously me. his relationship is stronger than what we might deem to know. You know what I'm saying? Didn't like J. if Cole he's saying Kendrick that Kendrick on though. 
No, listen. listen. Mm. Once, you, once you step in that booth and you decide to fire shots off, you that's why you can't compare mm-hmm. it because I'm never stepping in the booth. Mm-hmm. Right, right, right. That. But the difference is, I'm, but check it out. The difference is, though, the difference is, and I said this the last time we spoke about this, when he, when Kendrick said what he said, I didn't take that as a shot at Cole. You know what I'm saying? There wasn't nothing on that joint that he really shot at Cole, if we're going to keep it tall. That is a fact. You know what I'm saying? He really was shooting at Drake the whole time. Absolutely. Even the fuck the big three is not for me. That's not a shot at Cole. I said this No, he said it's just me. I said, I said, yo, listen, that for me, that was more of a, yo, listen, keep me out the conversation shit. I'm over here. Mm -hmm. Stop putting my name with other niggas type shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I didn't take that as a shot to Colt. You know what I'm saying? So if if he would have said, like if he would have threw a shot that I'm looking at it like, okay, this is a shot at Cole and then Cole do this, then that's different for me. Right. But I can't really, I can't go there because Nigga Kendrick ain't throw nothing, ain't really, you know what I mean? In my opinion, he ain't really throw nothing at the nigga. You know what I'm saying? He just, I think people just assumed it because he said, fuck the big three. The problem, the problem with that is if we listen to Kendrick over the years and years, he has claimed to be that guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if I he mean, didn't but... claim to be that guy, then this is a total different conversation. It's like, yo, leave me alone. <laughs> I never said I was that guy. Y'all bugging out. I'll be doing my own thing. But when you keep saying over the years, Lil, I'm that guy, I'm that guy, nobody's touching me, you're bugging out. And then when you finally do meet at moon mm-hmm. in the afternoon at 12 o'clock, 10 steps apiece, and you like, you know what? Hold on, you talking about Kendrick? I'm talking mm-hmm. about, Hold on, you're talking Cole. about Cole. I'm talking Cole. about Cole. 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 Yeah, I'm sorry. Over the over the years, Cole. This is this is why everybody believed him. That's a false prophet, bro. That you're leading us to believe, I, yo. I was behind J Cole, like yo. He the, you can't go out like that. You just can't. You're a hip hop artist. We look up to you. You hip hop, bro. You not even auto tune. None of that. You our leader, in this hip hop realm. So you supposed to ride this out. It wasn't gonna get personal. It wasn't gonna get any of that, bro. It was just yo showing my ex, my you know my. It was an exhibition match. But if you think about it, though, well, like if we talking about what we just said with him not really throwing a shot at Cole, then that means Cole just jumped out there brazy. You know what I'm saying? That makes so it even crazy. This, that, exactly. Cool. So that's what I'm saying. But I think that's where he comes from the standpoint of, yo, I feel like, nigga, this is the lamest shit I did, nigga, because he probably like really man. sat there. And thought about it, he like, yo, this nigga ain't even shooting at me, scrap. I just jumped out the window because everybody in my ear, everybody want me to reply, everybody want me to go, everybody want lyrical war, everybody want blah, blah. You know what I'm saying? Said that. So I got on that type of time, you know what I'm saying? And I went, you feel me? But there ain't no shot at him. If y'all niggas could tell me a shot right now, then we could have a different conversation. Yo. But there's not a shot, bro. Everybody. And I get what you're saying, it. HO, about... Yo, him being that nigga, but I and also when you at that stature at that point, I think everybody feel like they that nigga. All them niggas feel like they that nigga. That's why they, you. Yo, that's point, how you, you have, supposed to feel as an artist. You know what I'm saying we we know who the top three headed monster is. Now I understand. I get what y'all. I get what y'all do say. But this is what, what I'm saying. Say. If if that's his man, war, that's more important than letting. You know what I mean the toxicity. Right. You know, destroy that. You know what I'm saying? Like, clearly, if he's doing that, that's his guy, bro. You know so what? May I please jump that? Go ahead. I just got one. Yeah, yeah, right, no, I got that, more to say yeah, than one thing. Yeah, I ain't even yeah, yeah, no, man. I'm the host. Right. That's I, if that's the case, then this talk, we ain't we can't have this talk no more about J. Cole. It's over. It's between Kendrick and it's between Drake. Those are our two. Listen, we having this conversation, but yo, yes. but l- 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 hold on. Let me ask y'all this though, because okay, we having this conversation. But what is Drake doing? Oh, d- listen, that's what I'm. Listen, Drake. I ain't hear Drake throw no. nothing. Nah, nah, yeah, no, oh. no. Drake been throwing lines 
for now nah, we talking about saying his time. name we talking about saying we talking about as you know oh, the same way kendrick just went in the wall but you got to understand something when drake drop his next album he's going to say something Ken, drake never misses never misses the intent to come at a rapper when he gets the chance he is going to reply it's just that we have to wait for drake that's the only thing that's kind of wild. Yeah, this is what I'm saying though. But he gonna do it on some cute and an album and a single shit. That's not. That's not it though. No, you I'm saying know, like but you Kendrick shot him. at you multiple lines, and no, we and thing. you know we know who he was shooting at. You know is you. No, Drake could have let you. Then that Drake has never took you. Drake let you know he ain't. Get, first of all, Ken, Kendrick ain't even say Drake name, but. No, he said for all your dogs. Like, yeah, that's not, your not saying his name, bro. Stop that name. shit. But yeah, that's what? not saying his name. But Kid, Drake is way oh, more bro. slicker than that's that. He's gonna. Bro. No, like, that's word. not subliminal. But y'all bugging no, because oh, Drake oh, is oh, way. No, no, no. He said for all no, your no, dogs. No, I get what you're saying. Nah, I get what you're saying. That's not saying Drake's name. That was the name of his album. Bro, he did three. Yo, bro, hold on. That was the name. Then he read the reference. Hold it, then he Listen, made the reference. First of all, the amount of layers in that in that yeah, verse was ridiculous. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, right. But yeah. listen, if we go, he went three back to up. back. Yo, listen to the, he went three back to back straight to Drake. I still got T PSD and mother. He, he said the, the nigga, three John. Listen, really then like he that. said the Prince and Mike Jack John, which is clearly yeah. at Drake, because Drake keeps talking about he the Mike Jack of rap. If y'all niggas did not know, and then he said the, the, the for all you, all your dogs getting buried. That's a cave with these knives. Hey, I don't, don't even know why. If you did not know the relationship between them, and you did not know. Drake's Hold on, did he say the love it when they argue the hardest MC? Is it K dot? Is it RBO? Is it? I know he's talking about Drake because I can read him between the bars. But you know the background for a nigga that don't. Nah, I don't need no background. I know that the nigga. He's clearly shooting at that he's not holding back. We potted, I get, get it. it. I get it. He's bro. not he's not gonna say the nigga name because he's on wow. that's a verse on a song, bro. On another nigga song at that, that's a single. You know what I mean? So clearly he's he not name. gonna he jump out there and just around. say the nigga name. Yo, these niggas been going at it since control. They yeah, been going I ain't gonna lie. Don't, don't I? I right. listen, I'm I'm waiting because I Drake and I don't that's one thing Drake don't do is he go let you. Why wait till Drake drop his joint? He gonna say even a better slicking line. That's one thing Drake is really good at hitting you where it hurts. So Drake is Do going think to get better lyricists than K Dot. Drake ain't fucking with nah, K Dot. Oh, I can't wait. Yo, listen, hold on. K Dot is my guy. Hold up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Section eighty. Hold up. Whoa. whoa. No, there ain't nobody saying like no. Okay. But you make it seem, oh, making it seem like remember we don't. Oh. With, well, I, I'm gonna say we. Oh, oh, oh y'all. Oh, oh, he's old. Yo, yeah, bro, I'm you just saying you team OVO, bro. Yo, yes, you team OVO. I'm team uh, OVO. The okay. reason why is because ever since I known Drake, one thing about Drake, this ain't just song overall song and all that stuff. I just love Drake. Drake is just, you know, he's the greatest artist in my opinion when it comes he's to talented. this era. This era, he's the greatest artist. Like he's the, but he's, you know, he's the hybrid of this uh, this era. He sings, raps, he does everything well. But he makes uh, the hits. Yeah, he make the hits. He's he's that guy. Drake is that. We all know that. Deep down inside, we all know Drake is that guy. Come on, y'all can't deny that. He got I don't something. think. I don't know. Deep down I, inside, nothing. I don't I, believe that. Okay, okay, fair enough. Fair I enough. really right, don't yo. believe that. Can, 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 right, Do I, I think Drake is is talented? Absolutely. You know what I'm saying, but I don't believe he's that guy. He can't be that guy. It's not all possible. Right, so I gotta coordinate this right now. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. I can't spend too much time on this because we gotta move Why on. Why not? We can but talk I, about this all night. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> but other shit we're gonna talk about. But I do want to say my piece on this. I have to say my piece on this. Mm. So from the start, from when the comment that I made in the beginning, I said we're not gonna go back to the background. We're going back to where it just started just now. Mm -hmm. Your man K that said what he said about the big three line what he got from J. Cole. I agree with Wall. It was more like, yo, bro, don't put I, I, that nigga, lame nigga. Don't put my name with that nigga. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, he did it. J. Cole then responds on his project. He threw shots at this man. Both of them. Personal shots. Got, personal shots. Oh, my God. You so soft, bro. Personal shots. It wasn't nigga, even personal talked, shots, bro. Nigga talked about all his albums and how his. That's not personal. Broke. That's what I don't like. That's not personal. That is statistics. That's stats. That's, that's public. That's music. No, no, that that's, was, that's music. No, you can't know. 
Oh, that, that was a public, dish. Yo, hold on. That was a dish now. record, bro. Bro, that that's was a dish record. Kendrick right, did a so, verse on a song. That was and I get, Cole did a dish record, bro. People take the content, bro. This this record, niggas didn't even look at this shit as it was beef. Nobody looked at this shit as it was J. Cole and Kendrick beef. Because even the disc record that this nigga put out, it was no talking about guns, gangs, shooting, killing. It was that's not his style. Music. That's not J. Cole, though. He would never talk about actually throughout the mixtape. Are you serious? J. Cole don't ever talk about that. You don't he really don't. He even right said now? that in the mixtape. He said, Yeah, I only said that because that's niggas is lying in, in the middle of the mixtape. He said some shit about guns and he rebuttaled it like I only yeah. say I'm lying. I only said that because niggas be capping nowadays and kept it moving with his lyrics. He don't talk about that type of shit. Uh, J. Cole don't talk about no guns or nothing in his music, bro. Not really at all. This at nigga all. Is do you listen to J. Cole, bro? <laughs> yes, I do. Nah, Cole you can't name like a song. Cole don't Nick, really name a song, bro. bro. <laughs> you can't name a song. Is making it seem like this nigga did a diss record where he was coming at his neck. Even in his diss record, besides him talking about doing 30, 30 tracks is when we get one hit. Or your first album was hot, the second was quiet. That That's all talk nice. about your musical talent. He kept matter, music. Bro, that That's exactly, bro. It was not a beef. It was pure music. It was pure hip hop. Where this nigga could ha he didn't have to apologize for what he said. He didn't say nothing crazy. He's it so was funny, music. I'm, was I'm, he felt like he, but, but he, felt like he, Yo, no, no, he felt like he disrespected his man. He felt like he disrespected his man. Shit it on his catalog. I know what you're saying because that's what some soft niggas would say, bro. If that's my man. My man know exactly where I'm coming from, bro. If you're going to eat, bro, nah, hell no. Best, bro. Hell no. Ain't no way. Hell no. If you talk about my body of work, I feel way more better than my yo, body listen. of work than you, Mike. Yo, yo, I just told yo, you. Man. Yo, listen. I yeah, just told you. You can't. Tell me my album was wild. Yo, listen. I heard, heard clearly what you said, Wolf. Yo, but killer, you can't, you can't shoot. But you can't shoot. But, bro, you can't shoot. What, what is he shooting back for? For what? What is he shooting back for? What is he shooting back for? What was man, said that he got to shoot back? The man just clearly said, fuck the big three. Uh -huh. It's just me. Right. J. Cole was a part of that big three line because he was the one who said the line. Yeah. When you right. say that, that means J. Cole is not on top. You are not on top. I am on top. Y'all niggas don't exist. That's what he just said. Fuck the big three. It's That's just not. That me. wasn't a shot at Cole. I mean, in my opinion, that, that wasn't a shot at Cole, bro. Yo, that niggas is bucking. You listen, you reading, you're reading, listen. You sound right. like the internet. That's why yo, I listen, Cole's listen. Like yo, yo, I bro, listen. This man just told y'all. Yo, listen, no. That's listen, if Cole you're a Kendrick he... fan, yo, listen, if you're a Kendrick fan and you know Kendrick and you listen to Kendrick, Kendrick is not that basic, bro. Like niggas don't even understand or grasp the layers in that verse. Like that's not Kendrick is not doing that and just that's what y'all niggas gonna run with because y'all just y'all just reading what he said. So this, saying, is why, so this is why he's not he's not. Right he's right not. Right and everybody he's in the industry right now is like, yo, J Cole is bugging. So we all saying the same thing, but we not. Seeing nah, I just because they, they wanted to see the beef. Them. They, they want to see the beef. No, they want the they want the music, bro. They want the yo, listen. No, but, soul, bro. but everybody know, but everybody not joking though. But every, hey, hey, listen, everybody, listen, even Styles came out and said it. Styles said, yo, listen, I wanted to see it. Keep it tall it as an M. No, listen. He said, keep it tall as an MC. I wanted to see it. This would have been dope for the culture. Yes. But he said, I respect Cole a thousand times way more than what I did before for what he did because he didn't have to do that and i understand where he came from that's yeah, his he, man if he ain't want to get cooked yo you you cannot throw a shot at a nigga and throw nah, you, flag, you know what that shit is bogus, nah, i do want to like you know I, I i feel like that's absolutely 100 percent. it's just coming from i wanted to see it man. no cause, yeah coming <laughs> right and that's the same thing styles are saying following kit following j cole it's just sad to see that um you know we gotta see you just bow out gracefully bow out but it just changed it just changed people's perspective on him at this point it's going to affect him long long term down 
Only we'll against Kendrick. Again. If any art, other artists come at him like that, I think Cole would, would go in on him. No, but, but Kendrick the, is his man. But now it's like, uh, bro, it's you talking about two right now, two goats, two greats. We want to know who's greater. This was the opportunity to find out. This ain't no, it is a competitive sport at the end of the day. Just yo, like basketball, yo. just like baseball, just like football, just like boxing. Why y'all yeah, think nah, competitive listen. is out of the music, I, we, bro? Yeah, that's that's a fact, argument. but you, yo, but you got to take one very, you got to take this into consideration, bro. Once that man said, yo, this was not something I ever wanted to do. That says it all. He, th- th- this is not coming from him, bro. This is peer pressure at the least. That's all it is, bro. He what said it himself. He said, yo, listen, all my niggas, I, they by blowing up my jacket, they by hitting my phone as soon as the joint went down. All my niggas saying, yo, what's up? You got to shoot back. You got to. Fan, this is clearly that shows that he never, his intention was never to do he ain't want to do it at all. No. Yo, I always knew though. As yo, I ain't gonna lie. Ten years ago, I always kind of knew it would be J Cole, bro. It would be him to fall back, bro. I always he, he just that's he a that vibe, too. bro. Yeah, he gave me that vibe. That's a fact. Bro. He always that's gave me fact. that vibe. That's man, a fact. It's, it's tough, Kendrick man. is the dog, rough, rugged, raw. J Cole is the I'm a chill, play with <laughs> words, and I'm a fall. Yeah. Yo, yo cool. don't, and you made don't a call yourself and you chill, don't, don't crown yourself. You can't cry yourself. Yeah, it's over, J. Cole. It's over. You can't yo, go with yo. this. Hey, I, I, I believe them, Killer. Yourself, I believe them, y'all. Yo, I, Killer, I look. J. Cole was above. Hey. He was a prophet to me, bro. It was yo, no killer, God, look. It's over, bro. Yeah, it's over. You, and you and you made a, you know what I'm saying? You made a point that I think it speaks to exactly Cole mindset. You know what I'm saying? Is if you listen to the record, you said, you said, yo, Cole ain't say nothing brazy on that, John. He ain't say nothing That's crazy, the bro. point. That shows where his mindset was. But if he was really shooting, I'm going to say, I'm going with He going to dumb out. Cle- nah, clearly, he tried on. to keep it. He tried to keep it at a certain, all right, I'm going to keep this shit music. I ain't going to wild out, dumb out. Nah, see, I, I, I never thought it was, hold up. Y'all, y'all actually thought it was. I never thought it was. Off, that's what I'm saying. Off of Who music? bought this shit? No, I, no, no, no. I, not, I, no, that's that, not what that I'm saying. A, no, what I'm saying is he didn't dumb out on some, like Killer was saying, talking about some shit that he don't normally talk about. Well, that's what made me feel like it was- Clearly it was he kept the record on some rapping shit. Know what I'm saying that's and just trying to keep it- that's why, I, that's why I thought it'd been just a competitive thing. Yeah, where, a where competitive like, thing. Like, like, I think niggas took it out of perspective. I thought it was just, all right, nigga, we going, we going, nigga, we going to get them niggas- No, no, but yeah, but, but this is what I'm saying. But look, what I'm saying, <laughs> this is what I'm saying. It's not that I'm saying, yo, anybody, I, of course, I ain't think it was going anywhere else. It's rap, you know what I'm saying? But there's two different ways to rap. We know this. Like, if we hear Kendrick verse, his verse is way more aggressive, you know what I'm saying, than Cole shit. Cole is rapping and just saying certain shit, you know what I mean? Obviously, throwing shots. But he's throwing shots about the album, like shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Or you wouldn't be... uh we wouldn't be talking about you if it wasn't about this this I'm, shit or whatever. I'm da, 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 da. I'm glad you're saying that. I he not on that. some that burning tattoos. Da, 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 mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> feel now, like now, Kendrick on some whoa. other shit. Keep, keep it right there, Wool. Exactly what you're saying. This is my point. Ken, J. Cole, or Kendrick, but J. Cole did not throw personal. Like, hot, I mean, far personal is he talked about his album. And his him not doing music and being that okay, that's not personal. That's some regular shit. He didn't give us anything that we didn't know about his man. Right, he right, didn't talk right. about his big moms. He didn't talk about his kid. We ain't know. He didn't yeah, he ain't gonna, yeah. Okay, he, 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 well, that's disrespectful. That's that's. that's I mean, he did. I mean, he did let us know something we ain't know because I didn't think Cole doing Kendrick shit was ass. <laughs> right, no, but, but, <laughs> I, yeah, he didn't get disrespectful. He did I get thought personal. that album was. I, I, I thought rated, that yeah. album was fine. Nah, he just that's I, he trolled. I think he trolled. He just trolled. Right. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad we cleared that up because when I heard it, I didn't look at this as a. I didn't look at this as a. Beanie Siegel and Jada type shit. I looked at this like, oh, right, these right, niggas right. is having fun. He didn't get personal on the nigga he know because 
Kendrick and J. Cole fuck with each other. They know each other. They know some shit we don't know. None of them. You wanted to hear some disrespectful person. Oh, I did it. No, you not listening. Nah, hell no. I didn't, nah, I didn't want to hear that. Okay. I didn't want to hear that. Exactly yeah. What was said. Yeah. Okay. We've, been was said. To, we've been listening to. We've been listening to. Um. 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 Ice Spice. We listen to Sexy Red. We've been hearing females for the last past two fucking months, three months. We finally got some artists that we respect. And we had some music finally, and this nigga just threw the white flag and just threw all that shit away on us. When y'all niggas didn't even get personal, bro, that's my beef. The artists that got similarities are Lupe Fiasco, Common, all those guys, and none of those guys are backing down from a a bar to bar spa. We bar don't have to, bar, to get bro. disrespectful. We can keep it rap. We can, you know, but we don't have. It would have happened. J Cole it, it, just was like. Hey, I'm done. That's crazy to me because cool. I am a huge fan of Lupe Common. Those mm-hmm. are my guys. Like, those are the guys that, you know what I mean? Like, the rappers that really freestyle. You know what I mean? I admire so that. That's still listening. art. So you done with J. Cole? You're not going to listen to the fall off? No, listen. J. Cole is... I'm just saying I'm done with J. Cole as to where you can't... Kendrick's the king, bro. Kendrick is that... Which we said yeah, last king, week, we all agreed Kendrick was that guy. And it's going to fold. And I feel like Drake is that guy, too. I don't know who go win this, but it's gonna be fun to it's gonna be fun to listen to Drake and and, and, uh, and Kendrick. All right, we gotta move on to another topic, but uh, man, I'm glad we spoke about that. But we love J Cole. Don't get it twisted. We, we love, love J Cole. Cole. Let me let me tell you one thing about this rule before I got off. The dope shit about this, I like Kendrick, but I wasn't as deep of a Kendrick fan as like y'all are. Cause like y'all listen, listen to Kendrick. But this, when I heard this happen, Hop is the, this I, 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 I want to say Hop is the biggest country fan. I'm man, a kid, man, but I'm also a very a cold fan. No, no, no. But see, nah, I am a diehard. I've been listening hard. to Kendrick for dumb long. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, okay, 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 okay. Listen, whoa. But I'm a diehard J. Cole Kendrick. Okay, like, I'm that. talking Friday Night Lights. Friday like, night when night I was... Night. When I was going through my worst times and I didn't, I, night I popped that mm-hmm. on. When I had to drive okay. wifey to work every morning mm-hmm. in the snow, okay. I was listening to Friday okay. Night Lights. I have a, you know what I mean? That was the era of, and that then when shit. I found out, I'm like, oh, J. Cole gave Kendrick the beast for Section 80. I was mm-hmm. like, oh, shit, somebody, pardon my language. I was like, oh, this is beautiful. Like, the next generation is lit. These are the leaders. So, like Hop said, like Big Friday Night Lights, I could tell you every J. Cole album, but I can't tell you every Kendrick shit. But this shit that they just did gave me the opportunity to actually go listen to Kendrick. So now I finally dived into Pimp My Butterfly. I ain't really dive into that shit like that. I ain't listen to the Heartbreak Part 1, 2, 3. Now I listen to all. Yo, I got a chance to actually dive into Kendrick music a little bit more. And, and and really appreciate it. Like, this shit made me appreciate both of them. But I appreciate Kendrick a lot more. And Kendrick is on top, bro. Yeah, absolutely. That's it. For me, Kendrick is on top, bro. Absolutely. So, so a quick vote before we go out of here. Who's going who? who? I'm going with Cole. You're going with Kendrick. Kendrick oh, no, Cole going, is bro. out of here. What do you mean, Cole? There's no Cole. It's for you, Cole, bro. It's what for you? How is it? Why he bowed down? He said, "I'm done, bro." Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. What are yeah, you talking over, about, bro? I'm still See, rocking is, with Cole. Yo, Cole, these are the fans you don't want. How are you still rocking with Cole? He's not the bro. He's done, bro. He's so you, so you, he's you over. Are still rocking with Cole. No, so but we're not think, talking about that. Ooh. You said you got to vote. What are you voting? We're not right. voting on niggas who we still fucking with. You, oh, okay, you okay. said, well, you, said like, you voted Cole. I know we I'm vote voting Kendrick. that Cole is still on top of Kendrick. I'm voting that. That's what I was saying. Y'all, oh. y'all, could, y'all could disagree that. But oh, that's you what just mean. said he's... <laughs> if you, if you the numbers person. Nigga ain't got better numbers than him. Fuck he does. I, he does. He has all, all his albums did better than, than, than Kendrick's. He sold more total records. Don't get me with the numbers. Don't give me the number. He sold more oh, total bro. records than Kendrick. You We're are, not gonna go there though. We're bro, not gonna you go there. You are though. bugging out, bro. We're not gonna go no. there. Ain't no way this man <laughs> literally <laughs> sat on bro. stage and said, "Yo, I'm bro. out of this. I'm We're done." Go He's still but, talking about. I still got Cole. Jay Cole I still got Cole. That nigga did a bitch move, bro. That nigga. I don't like the. I don't like that the beef didn't happen, but I still got Cole over Kendrick. That's that soft. That's soft. I'm soft. I'm just saying. I'm explaining. It's not a beef. It's not a beef. Stop saying beef. That's what y'all getting mixed up. Kendrick and Cole has no beef. Whatever the disc, whatever you right. want to call it, whatever it was, whatever you want to call it, whatever you want to call it, it's hip hop. 
And Kendrick, okay. I mean, and J. Cole was the first I, rapper. I can't wait to the fall off. That's all. <laughs> I wait. I want to hear Kendrick's diss if he's still doing it, and I want to hear the fall off. And I want the fall off coming out. Well, she might want to suspect the cold. <laughs> the fall off his album, but Yo, his actual album about to come is, out. is that he ain't gonna have nothing to do with Kendrick or or Drake, bro. Okay, he, okay. he's taking a different route, bro. We gotta respect it. He's okay. taking a different route. He doesn't, you know what I mean? And as a hip hop, as hip hop fans, we all we gotta respect that. But we can't put him in the mix now. Still in the mix, it's over, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, I, I'm because right. if we I'm really want to be that my I ain't gonna okay. do it. That'd be another one. Because yo, listen, there's a lot of MCs that's really crazy, but they Lupe, he's a monster. My guy, a Lupe, my guy. Mm-hmm. He could be right there with them. Like there's no, mm-hmm. but lyrically? You know what I mean? lyrically, he's right there with them, bro. And he's he, you know what I mean, he got enough songs to hits to say, yo, I'm right here. I'm not one of these underground dudes. You know what I mean? But it is what it is. He would have battled, bro. Real, 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 real hip hop niggas would have battled, bro. That's a fact, bro. Ball for ball, niggas ain't backing down for no ball for ball. You could be my brother, and we still go spa, bro. Word, you and niggas get on the court and do this shit every day with their brothers. Niggas get on the basketball court with the best. Nigga, I'm the greatest. Now I'm the great. Nigga, show me. Nigga, nigga, you see, you you see nuts at the top of the roof. Nigga, we be battling, bro. This is respect. The art respect the competitiveness. What y'all doing right now is taking the competitiveness out of music, and that's crazy. J. Cole just disrespected hip hop, bro. I just and think, no, nah, I, I, I just think he that. respects Kendrick to that. I do think that if anybody else said anything, Cole would take their head off. Yo, you like know what's crazy? It's, I find that very ironic how you can sit there and say he respects y'all drunk that Kool Aid. He respects Kendrick so much that he had enough time to put all that shit down on wax, hear it more than once, make sure it was correct, and put that shit out. Waiting for the fans to, oh, ah, and then turn around and tell y'all niggas, yeah, that's my man. I was speak out fools for that shit, for believing that bullshit he put out, bro. That's crazy. That was a sucker move, and J. Cole know that shit. He just went against uh, the see, see, the way you, the way you put it there, <laughs> the nigga put it together. Right, heard it, I, I, mixed it. Yeah, he, look, because mm-hmm. niggas put the battery in his back. It was like, yo, oh. I'm gonna respond. I'm gonna do that. Yes, he told you that. Then, then, but let's no. That's just when you when you actually look at what happened once he put the song out and people were reacting to it like, oh shit, he said this about Kendrick and da da da, and they started getting the backlash like, oh, he's going in on Kendrick. Then he started feeling some type of way because he because he because he told you that. So it was nothing. That, so you don't even see a ego trip for somebody that said they are the king of this. J. Cole said he's the king of this. So when you hear somebody else say, you're not the king, I'm the king, you trying to tell me that's not going to just make that man do what he did? Because he probably, whatever, I don't know what that man think. Now you know what else. So why y'all keep saying this, his people put, because he said that to y'all. Oh, man, people put the bag in my back. So, I, so now you just listen to every nigga behind you. And you just go walk. That normally happens. You act like that's not out of the ordinary. <laughs> like, nah, you know what else too? The actual <laughs> y'all that I probably yeah. think Kendrick was. I mean, uh, J Cole was probably thinking was, dang, hold up, I'm hanging out with Drake. Now I'm coming at. Now I'm coming at. Yeah, that shit all crazy. And I know, and I know, I know K Dot not hanging with Drake, and that's yeah. my boy. So now it looked like it's me and J Cole. I uh, J Cole and Drake. Uh, yeah, we ganging up on King Dot or K Dot, you know what I mean? So it could be like maybe he was thinking that too, though. Like, man, I'm on tour with Drake, I'm I'm on stage with Drake, which is making Drake just look like the freaking man. Yo, oh, yeah, that's making Drake look like the master man, like the, like master, the master, the final <laughs> boss, bro. Like, bro, this is I'll make these two bro. dudes take each other out. Yeah, yeah bro. Just... Drake so let me ask you something, hey, so what you saying that I how much can we believe that I don't know their relationship? Like that, they say they cool, cool. Mm-hmm. But how much is J Cole that much of a K dot being his man that much, and you affiliated with niggas that he don't rock with like that? That's a question he, that. Yeah, that's that's true. That's a question that you got to ask J Cole. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, I'm sure K dot go give him the yo go get your money, but you know that's a question you got to ask. I, I don't. Kendrick not with that dog. And, 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 and I think that top dog out. in the main with that bro. I yeah. think that came out on this project, bro. It just really questions how much of that, oh, is that your man, bro, that you lashed back? That nigga wrote 
a line that wasn't even really directly towards you and you lash back like that that would have me question like nigga you really my man or what you know what when you say that you know what i probably i think they had a conversation i think k dot and j cole had a conversation they probably did prior well, prior to that dream fashion yeah they probably did yeah he, well j cole probably ain't speak them in a while i don't know we can't but i do know k dot has a different kind of fire i am the best yeah. i am the best i am the best I with an iron fist. I want to rule this with an iron fist, and J. Cole's not like that. And that's understandable. Respect. 